That's a song called Sometimes that I co-wrote and co-produced with Questlove for another Philly native, Bilal. Um, I've known Bilal for a long time. I first met him when he was a teenager and he was singing with this choir in Philly called Youth Delegation. Uh, Bilal is renowned for having like this crazy voice and he was singing these really high notes and crazy runs and just real advanced melodically and harmonically you know he was that dude so I passed cross again sometime later uh, up in New York he'd gone to school in New York and um, he was working on his debut album and me and Amir would work in uh, Electric Lady Studios in New York quite a bit and he would be in there hanging out working on his stuff um, he was always rolling around with this kind of tall dude these goofy dreadlocks I think his name was something uh, Rob Glasper or something and yeah, whatever so we decided to do some music we would be uh, going to the lab for a few days coming up with some ideas yada 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 one day we're working in the studio and Common rolls through now that's not too uncommon bad joke uh, for, for, for him to roll through everybody sort of came through Electric Lady Studios and that's where a lot of people were working on their stuff at that time so he comes through and uh, he's just a little upset that's like well, what's the problem man he said man I was up for this movie role for this movie called Carmen and starring Beyonce and the role that I wanted to get most deaf got so you know we feeling bad for our boys so we do what you know brothers do we start clowning them start teasing them actually let's change that they started it anybody that knows me knows that I'm not the type of person to tease any of my friends all my friends will tell you that that's not who I am so anyway we start clowning common we start playing uh most death songs and and destiny Ch destiny's child songs just you know changing the lyrics up and messing with them we started playing like umi says and uh the the destiny's child song at the time was bill so so we're playing and then just having fun and cracking jokes at his, his expense. And he's, of course, laughing and he's firing jokes off back at us because that's the type of person he is. You know, he's a troublemaker. Anyway, so we're playing the stuff for like 15, 20 minutes laughing. And everybody's like, hmm, this is starting to morph into something. So Umi says... morphs into hmm. and uh sort of morphs into we're like hold up we we got a song here so we we with the help of uh our big brother my big brother one of my favorite people on earth the bass god pino paladino we tracked the song uh now belial writes an incredible song you know a, a story of uh what self-reflection and who he is as a man in this world and um boom we have a song Again, we tease Common. Of course, he's not thinking about it now. He's got Emmys. He's got Oscars. He's got Motor Trend, Car of the Year. He's, you know, he's whatever. But you never know where inspiration is going to come from. It could come from clowning one of your boys. Mm -hmm. 